To some, the sand hills of west central Nebraska is an underappreciated ecosystem, but these grasses are the life source for the Cooksley Ranch near Anselmo. But if you'll notice, there's no cedar trees on this terrain, and huge sand patches show signs of what happened here a year ago, the wildfires of April 2023. If I could wave a magic wand and make it not happen without any question, it would not happen. Sparks from railroad tracks and lightning set ablaze 40,000 acres and 90% of the Cooksley Ranch's summer range. So within that is back to that optimistic, show me what I got, figure out what you've got, and then figure out how you're going to utilize it. The flames took out 20,000 fence posts, leaving the Cooksley Ranch with a million dollar bill to replace them. We've had a lot of these fences have been burned quite a few times, and we've never seen this kind of damage. The Cooksley Ranch property was divided into squares in the early 1900s. The wildfires forced them to consider where to replace 50 miles of burned fence line. Uh, you know, we wanted to use it more like the bison had done in the past. They didn't go up and down over a hill, they went the valleys. They're working on the federal level to get flexibility with defining fencing parameters. Another project, replenishing 4,000 feet of burned shelter belt trees. This should be a treeless, grass-covered plain. But some trees are still useful to shade cattle. The Cooksleys said the cattle mostly ignored the burned areas, but during calving season, they relied on man-made shades to block the wind. The Cooksleys replanted juniper trees and shrubs. The young. Cooksley crew that's in the yard. This will be your project. The Cooksley Ranch received help from the Emergency Conservation Program, the Natural Resources Conservation Service, the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Partners Program, and other resources. In the meantime, the plants pushed through last year's drought to this year's rains. But it's, it's nice to see an ecosystem like this where it's responding, where you're taking care of it. George Cooksley said the wildfires even made him consider more prescribed burns that lessen the intensity of unplanned fires. Go after it because my experience with wildfires had made me negative fire. Now I'm just negative wildfire. In the end, the aftermath lit a fire in many ranchers to continue being stewards of the land. Not just for the cattle, the families and the communities that call them home, but these grasslands do so much to benefit us all through cleaning our water, cleaning our air, and giving us the healthy soil we need. For Pure Nebraska, I'm Grace McDonald.